Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm excited because I'm coming to you guys with a new subscription services and it is on the Wantable makeup box. Now this is a, a more expensive uh, monthly subscription. You can pick between makeup, jewelry, I think now they have a health box and lingerie okay so this box is $36 a month with the monthly subscription and it will be $40 a month if maybe you just want to try out one box so you get four to five full-size items or deluxe full-size items for $36 a month it's not bad you usually get well over $50-$60 dollars worth of product in the box so that's not bad so I'm just gonna open it up I broke the seal and I haven't opened it yet so, oh, it says especially packed for Evie. And that's my name, it's Evie. It says, hope you enjoy your first collection. So they're welcoming me, that's great. So I get a paper that says the stuff I received and how much, and also has my address and stuff like that, so I don't wanna pop it out there. But I do have this, it does have the stuff here that I like and don't like. So I my dislikes was nail polish. So my likes were eyeliner and tools. So I kept those as likes, not saying that I won't receive them, but that it will probably be on the least priority to get. Um, lip colors, I kept everything pretty much open to try except for like some cream products. I'm just going to open this up and it is packaged very nicely with some foam. I see four items here. Oh, okay, never mind. So this box is intriguing me. This is a small box and it's it's from Seralt uh, Mascara. It's, okay, it's mascara. It's very small for mascara. It's 0 0.06 ounces. So this is a very small box for a mascara and this is very small. They do supply you with deluxe full-size products. Oh my gosh, that is a small, let me see. That is a small wand. Oh good, doesn't stink. This will be perfect for getting it on the little lashes on your bottom lash line and also on the inner part of my eye. I have difficulty there. Mascara is $26, okay. So the next thing here is I'm assuming an eyeshadow and it is from Pla Be Beauty. It's called Velvet Rope. I don't know how to describe this color, go figure. It is like a taupe, um, more on the purple with maybe a little maroon iridescence to it. Very slight, it kind of tends to go golden. It is pretty. This, this would be a color I would recommend using for all over the lid. It's not like pow pigmented, but I do have a lot left on my finger, so it might go on better than swatches. Beauty with a Wink eyeshadow shimmer and I'm assuming the color is timeless, even though it says velvet rope, but that could be the finish of it, so I don't know. The retail for this is $18, holy crap. I see a Vincent Longo Duo Lip Pencil, and the color is Naked slash Pumpkin. It's cruelty free. Okay, so I swatched them, and I'm gonna put them backwards. So this is Pumpkin, and this is Naked, and both colors are colors that I would use uh, under a lip look, on top of a lip look, or as a lip look. So that is nice. So let's see. The dual lip pencil is $26. Holy crap. On a cracker. All right. So the last item here is from Mirabella, and I've heard of this brand before, and I'm assuming this is a lip product. It's a rose velvet lip pencil. It looks like a chubby pencil. Okay, maybe not. So this is something that, oh, this is a really pretty color. That's a nice vibrant pink, looks like. So this is something that you sharpen, it looks like, so, oh. Like butter, oh my god, look at that. Like, look at that, like I'm barely touching my hand. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do a big old square swatch. Oh, look at that. The shade is in rose. This is really pretty. Actually, it would look really pretty on, over top of the lipstick I'm wearing right now. In case you want to know, it's the Gerard Cosmetics all the, all the what I have on my lips. The Mirabella Velvet Lip Pencil in Rose, gorgeous, oh my god, is tw $23. I had to look that over twice. That's, that's pricey. So this box was $36, and the grand total of this box was $93. So for my first box, I'm actually really excited. I received four items, and I can't wait to try them. So I will leave all their info down below so you can check them out. And because I decided to 
pretty much eliminate my other subscription services besides my FC, keeping that. Um, I decided to just kind of splurge on the Wantable box because it's pretty much the same price that I was spending on the two other subscription services that I left and I was not satisfied. So let's try this out for a few months and see if I'm excited about it. I did do a review on this box about a year and a half ago and I liked it then and I'm sad that I did not keep it. So yeah. <laughs> so if you guys like this video please thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and yeah I'll see you guys in my next video love you guys bye